and uh, Northview in the second half. Well, I think uh, Mike Allen telling his kids, you know, take take better care of the basketball, continue to work to the post, try to do a better job of you know, getting some people in and out of the post and finishing plays. Reigns with a finish there. And I think clearly what Lou Ann Anderson telling her teams is, look, we need to go, we need to attack the glass. We can't settle for three. We've got to move. And the other thing we've got to do is a better job defensively in the post, find uh, Francesca uh, McCarthy, and for heaven's sakes, take better care of the basketball. Steal, turnover, steal, foul. She battles it. She she is certainly not a one-dimensional player. By Spring Reigns, the 5'7 senior. Yes, that is her sister, Stormy, and their other sister is a statistician, and her name would be, Coach? Sonny. There you go. Great family. You know, very supportive of one another. Had there been quadruplets, what, Autumn maybe? Rain- like you. Monrovia has the Stanford triplets who yep. are seniors this year. Joe Jordan and their sister Jessica. They were honored at senior night in the Branch McCracken Memorial Gymnasium the other night. The other night. Oh, Kelly Meggs forcing the turnover. How about, and granted, I mean that's great defensive effort on the part of Kelly Meggs, but uh, unfortunately a lot of these turnovers have not been due to some tremendous pressure. Meggs flips it in the corner. Kettner. Great pass. Looks inside. Shot blocked from behind by Reigns, and she gra- grabs it up. In transition, she'll come. Go up quickly, allowed the defense time to get there and get a good block. That's a two-pointer. It's an air ball. Had a foot on the line. Emily Adams with a rebound for Terre Haute North. Kettner in transition quickly. Comes to Meg. She'll spot up for three from the left wing and throw up an air ball. Still 27-21. Reigns with a three. 18 so, points for Spring Reigns. You need to find her when she comes across because she can knock down the three. You can't allow her to get off the bounce with not a hand in her face. 27 24, three point lead. Terre Haute North with the basketball. And an answer. How about that? Daniel yep. Kettner has a couple of three pointers and six points. How about a penetrating pitch? We talk about it a lot in football. Answer a score with a score. He got it off the uh, penetration and pitch. Knights in transition. Little 15-footer is way short by Webster. Rebound tracked down by oh. Kettner. Kettner picked up the dribble for some reason. Almost traveled with it. McCarthy. Uh, just come out of the locker room still, I think, a little tight. Just not able to establish themselves. Get in any rhythm at all. Good drive. Webster's shot. Rolls around and out. Ball loose on the floor. Reigns with it from 15. Rolls around, rolls around, rolls around and out. Rebound by Adams. Traffic will clear. She'll go to Lindy Jones. 30-26. Patriots with the lead. McCarthy shut off. Baseline's there. If she takes that route, decides to go to Meggs instead. Meggs to Jones. Throws it up off the glass and in. Seven for Lindy Jones. Just a great move. Great jump stop. Collected herself. Got the nice left-hand layup in against pressure. Big basket, Mark. Bumps it up to eight. 32-24, Terre Haute North, five-minute mark of the third quarter. Double team in the corner. Deep three, rolls around and out. A misfire for Stormy Reigns. Adams has controlled the boards here in this half for Terre Haute North. Kettner looking, comes to Megs. Megs will back it out and restart the offense. Jones, left wing, comes to Adams. But the thing about her is she's knocked down some threes. She's gotten to the free throw line. She's been opportunistic. She's, When things have presented themselves, she's been right there. Megs, McCarthy, Jones, Megs, three, yes. You can't leave her open. You've got to get a hand in her face. Eight Again, for Megs, and the lead has ballooned to 11 now at 35-24. Yeah, and in a hurry it got to 11. Deep three, bump, and no call. That was a foul. Reigns was fouled. No call. Yeah, from up here, that was a foul. McCarthy to Meg. She'll drive, throw it up in a double team. And Whether, you know, made or missed. That one's a clanger off the back of the iron. McCarthy's there with a window. Kettner cross courts it. Lindy Jones wants three and gets the friendly bounce. She's in double figures with yeah. 10. Northview's going to take a timeout yeah. here. Uh, and they do have some, they have the inside out threat. And they've been playing well at both ends of the floor. Nearly a turnover. Emily Phillips open from the right elbow. Throws it up a little short. Megs with a rebound. She'll use the dribble to clear traffic. 
Come to Jones. Jones spots up for 16. It's a quick shot. Same yeah, back yeah, in bounds. Yeah, not a bad shot off transition. Probably could have could have been better if with one or two more dribbles to the hoop. Turnover at Northview. Jones with it in transition. A little dribble drive. Comes to Meggs. She'll reset at the three-minute mark. That's a good, good possession here. Just take some time. Get yourself under control. Try to bump it up two more points. little step through. Finger roll. Won't go. Oops. McCarthy has it for a moment. <laughs> How about it? Comes it? down into the hands of the Northview Knight lying on the floor. Fell right into the hands of Stormy Rain. Spring gets it. Goes to Kimball. Kimball turned around from five. Won't go. McCarthy fights for the rebound. 15-point advantage for you in a hurry. Meggs with a basketball. Kettner checked in during the stoppage in play. Meggs gets a little screen. Plays the give and go. There for the easy deuce as Etling can't finish it. Didn't make the hoop and once again, things happen. 15 points for McCarthy, the five foot nine inch junior, 41 24. Terre Haute North running away from Northview. Meggs off the turnover, going to drive to the bucket, let the traffic clear, throw it up short. But there to clean it up is Lindy Jones with 12 now. Well, she's got a quiet 12, but again, it's a great defensive effort that creates the turnover with no shot. And now it's 19. An unbelievable quarter. The advantage was seven. That's either on the dribble or off the pass. Stormy Reigns with the kick to Carly Bell. Bell redirects. 17-footer won't go by Kelsey Searing. I'm wondering if, if Northview's going to be able to, to get anything on the on the board. Lindy Jones with a drive and the finish. 14 for Lindy Jones. Well, she's had a spectacular quarter. 40. And bumped this up to 21, and uh, it, it's gotten away from Northview in a hurry. Rains. Great offense. Nice Great pass offense. down low Great in there offense. to finish it up as Kelsey See, Searing. You come out of a timeout, you run that. That's a good, it's a good play, but... They need much more of that now. The uh, Northview's going to go, has to go man at this particular stage. 45 26. Shot down low. Isle Brock puts it up. Can't finish it. The save inbounds into the hands of Carly Bell. Great pass. Bell runs it ahead to finish. Range and she finishes. See, Stormy good Range with out. seven. Coach Lou Ann Anderson getting the timeout, getting two scores out of it. Kids have more energy. 45 28 the score, under a minute to play. Little half court trap. Loose ball being fought. Bell on Birkins. A little weave, a little ball screen. That's an air ball there. She's ready for the rebound, and she got a chance. 45-28, 32 ticks left on the clock. Fights for the rebound, scramble for the loose ball. Controlled by Kettner. Kettner in transition, runs it ahead to Lindy Jones, and that was not a beneficial turn of events for Northview. They missed two free throws and give up an easy one on the other end. Spring Reigns in the corner. Blocked by Jones. Comes down into the hands of Kettner. She defensively played well. Isle Brock's third personal foul, by the way. Free throw no good. Fighting for it to Spring Reigns. Fights through a no. Make it 19 anyway. 20 for her now as she's good on both attempts. 47 31, 16 points the lead. Eilbrock in transition. But you don't want to foul somebody 30 feet away from the basket. Kettner from 16 throws up an air ball. 47 31. It was a big quarter for the Patriots of Terre Haute North.